please click on the red subscribe live? button yes, below are, right? this video oh, okay. and subscribe to our <laughs> YouTube channel. All right. Welcome on board the men's room. How are you? How have you been? All good? Mm -hmm. My name is Onimisi Adaba and um, yes, I'm okay. I'm well. So far, so good. Yeah, looking forward to um, the weekend. Um, July is almost finished. Gosh, how, it, how time flies. Okay, so if you're tuning in again, welcome to the men's room. And um, what we do here is just to talk on issues um, relating to us men, about us men as it relates to, you know, family, the wife, the ladies, society, industry, and all of that. And today, what I'm talking about today is, um, well, if, you've, if, you, if you're following me on Facebook, you realize that I have, um, <laughs> why did I get married up and running up there? Yeah? No, no, not Tyler Perry. No, not that one. This, this is a different one. All kinds of people getting married for all kinds of reasons here and there and all of that. We'll be talking about that right here in the men's room. We'll take a quick break and when we come back, I'll let you in on it. I've got two lovely ladies and I'm taking it from their perspective. Why the ladies? I'll let you in when we come back. Yeah? The men's room right here. Um, stay with us. Do you want me to go for the 60 yard now? Now what we do is either go for it now or wait till when it's almost 8 o'clock. So you take 6.30 and 8 and seven. How long is 6.30? That place is pretty long. And now, back to men's room with Onimisi Adama. Why did I get married is the question. And why are we asking this question? You know, all kinds of things happen, you know. Uh, people get married for all kinds of reasons. I'm telling you, all kinds. Let's see now, what can I tell you? Emotional reasons are the most noticeable reasons for um, people to get married. The companionship, romance, and love, you know, a couple shares can compel them to make uh, that commitment to spend the rest of their lives together. Couples should carefully examine their emotional motivation for marriage before they commit, you know, to do so. Before they commit to say all of them, I do's, I do's, I do's, and all of that. But, you know, a whole lot of times, especially these days, all kinds of things are happening, wouldn't you say? You know, from business deals to um, thinking that it's the next logical thing to do, you know, um, uh, financial feelings or financial should I say obligations and all of that and so it throws marriage into what we have or what is now termed as irreconcilable differences and we're just gonna have a conversation around this you know today I say we because I have um, well I didn't care somewhere 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 in, somewhere on the island she should be knocking on the door any moment now so I got two lovely ladies I got a young man, but um, somehow, somewhere, he's not here. Uh, I decided to get, um, you know, singles, you know, just to hear from their perspective. I mean, you figure out, go get married people and talk, but no. I figured to get um, some single people uh, just to hear their perspective and what is really going on, you know, because honestly, I'm really glad I got married when I got married. Otherwise, it have just been a conundrum for me right now. I'm telling you, truly, what I hear, what I see, what they say, it's like, gosh, what's going on? And so I've got me in the house aisle, Ayo Thompson, lovely lady, yeah, the TV lady, the uh, media personality, uh, what else can I call you? What else? Media personality. Come on, let's boost your mind. <laughs> uh -huh, there we go. Media personality wow. would be fantastic, mm -hmm. first and foremost, right here where <laughs> it all started. Nigeria, in, oh, your number one talk news and sports station. There we go. Thank you for there the invitation. Mm -hmm. You know, God, this is, this, is a, this is the first time in the men's room, right? It is. We've always talked behind the scenes. Yes, we have. Been a, I'm telling you, she's been a great resource person for me. The men's room, she brings in people, brings in all kinds of stories. How she get how she. <laughs> Anyway, but here she is in the men's room, and we're just going to be talking about this. Um, Adenike is going to join us, and hopefully a dear friend of ours, Snoozy, um, TL, uh, T. Lawrence, will join us in, hopefully. If it doesn't, it's okay. You two can join in. We'll pop the lines open later on for you to make your calls, yeah, if you want to talk about... You want the lines now? 
Okay, tell you what, I'll let you have the lines now, but it doesn't mean you'll call now. Let's just have a chit chat first before you call. So let's hit the lines. Us on 01 0127719930127719930127729930 and 0127739930 this is nigeria info we are listening loud and clear we are listening don't call now just have the numbers and um, have them for keeps for a couple of minutes i'll throw the lines open and you can call what would you call to tell me now exactly my point so just hang on and um let's hear uh let's have a chit chat with um ayo thompson here and um you guys will get to chip in later on why did i get married you aren't married i'm not yet married she's um, in the house ladies and gentlemen yay! <laughs> <laughs> Formula yeah we need to um, yeah. <laughs> shake the shake up for her she's in the house okay adenike thanks for coming Thank Good you. to have you in. Um, you made it through. Oh yes. How was traffic there? Crazy. Really? Just for me, Koi. I'm so sorry, I'm late. It's all but right. But I was listening to you guys. Mm. <laughs> Why am I getting married? I don't. You tell Why? me. Why, Why are you getting married? Get married Why, Why she's the one getting get married? married? Yeah. Why? And um, this is coming from you know conversation I've had with both of you at separate times. Oh wow. The crazy things happening in marriages now why people get married, the different reasons um, from a lazy man getting married to an active lady, you know, an, an active lady or rather a lady who just wants to get married to an already established man because in the name of, look, I don't do one so far. I don't want, no, I don't want potentials. I want to have, you know, stuff, who would chop potential, you know, stuff like that and all of that. And it ends up in what is known as irreconcilable differences. So, um, what is it? What, 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 what can you guys say? All right, okay. It's interesting we're talking about this because I, I, I mean, I've had... <laughs> apart from me getting married. Now, because we are talking to the men. And we're trying yeah, we're talking to them. Yes, why do men want to get married in Nigeria today? Hmm. One of the reasons, which is quite unfortunate... Some are scared. Yeah, some are scared. Some, it's time. Some pressure from home. But a trend we have seen, mm -hmm. we, by we I mean women, yeah. have oh, I seen got you in here, yeah. is that men also want to get married to get an upgrade. Mm -hmm. So a financial upgrade, a, a status up, upgrade. So earlier status, today, status so you marry someone with a good name and mm -hmm. so your status automatically or overnight changes. Mm -hmm. Mr. Easy and... Oh, please, I was, I was trying <laughs> not to the go last there. Tour. I was, oh, because it's you interesting. Know, you're mentioning names. So on you know. the show earlier on, 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 the, on the TV show that I do earlier on, we spoke about this and this oh, was really? shows... Yes, and I was okay. like, oh my goodness, did you read the men's room script for, you know, um, Plants for Tonight? You should pay me some... some, some it's you that stole no, the no, idea. No, 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 they no, came no. before you. Was, uh, so this is what happened. Your bar actress, Liz Andrewin, said she cannot marry a man who is dependent on her. Mm -hmm. Now, the reason why a woman would now make it a criteria in today's world is mm. because it's becoming rampant. That's on her. That was on her. Yes. yes. Yeah. Now it's normal. So but why is it not okay? Why is it normal? Because Put every man course. wants to just enjoy in his life. Like <laughs> they've Nothing seen that. Nothing wrong But don't you think the reverse is the case where the woman will be like, look, I want you to enjoy. I don't want. To. That was what was happening in the past. Now the men have caught it's... up and they have taken over. <laughs> they've caught they've up. They've overtaken us. With honestly, I I was given an example earlier today about a man, mm -hmm. very well known man, but I'll protect his identity, mm -hmm. who said that he cannot date a girl that does not have at least a car. So in the past, where and it wasn't a matter of intellectual, we need to be on the same level intellectually. And I'm sure if a lot of ladies would speak up, they would un you would understand the struggle. A man is now looking for a, a made woman mm. because number one, he doesn't want to suffer and be the only breadwinner. So he wants somebody that would chip in. I have heard, I don't want to marry somebody who would be um, a liability. Yes, who would be a liability. Funny, At least let her work. At least let her do. That's fair enough. But yeah, I think I mean, we, we've moved past the era where our mothers, you know, were dependent on our fathers. And times have changed. Yes, and it's become clear, apart from the fact that we no longer can depend on one source of income, mm -hmm. you find out that a lot of women are now woke. Yeah. And um, we want to aspire to so many things. Mm -hmm. We want to become career women. We want to also juggle the home front. We mm -hmm. also want to be... Could that be a cause? Could that be... 
is that I, is that my cause? But no, I mean, could that be a cause? Could that be why men are like, hey, okay, so since no, what, I, I think that what a man can do, a woman can do better. <laughs> well, right? is, isn't that what we're pushing for? Isn't that the form of a starting um, interpretation of the equality that people think that we're pushing for? Mm -hmm. And I think that it's that um, narrative of being equal has lost its essence at a certain point in time. Mm -hmm. And for me as an individual, the example that I see is not what is playing out um, everywhere. Why do I want to get married? Can we just get married for the companionship? I want, I, I have a friend, I like a friend. Mm. Um, yeah, some people get married because somehow the lady gets pregnant. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the reasons yeah. differ. And in certain the instances... The ticking, for instance. Well, sometimes. And Especially for the lady. Uh, and the, 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 the clock of the biology... The, the way she <laughs> doesn't <laughs> <laughs> children, you know, they'll be so what I'm saying. You saw it all, don't catch it. No, but... Just the series. The reasons differ. I want companionship. Yeah. It, and I think that one of the... For me as an individual, we have to be friends. How can we not connect yeah. first? Uh, how can we... We cannot connect and then want to get married. It's absolutely impossible. How can you not connect with the people that matter to me? How can you not connect with the dreams that I have? How can we not rub, you know, minds on what you want to do, where I want to, what I want to do, where we want to be, where we want to have kids, what we want the kids to do? There would have to be, you know, setting. Um, Make way, make way, Lawrence. Da, ah, yeah. That would have to be setting. <laughs> I don't know, he's the man that you ever seen. <laughs> 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 I'm not the man. He has tormented me today. <laughs> 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 the yeah, good please. to have you here, Snoopy. <laughs> <laughs> I know when they said Lawrence, I was looking. <laughs> <laughs> it's that gentleman, no, no, that gentleman. So All right, just, 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 um, just by way of introduction, <coughs> Lawrence, um, Tony, Lo Tony Lawrence, <laughs> aka Snoozy. Yeah, right. Um, he's he's uh, aka time. Smoothie. Okay, Smoothie, <laughs> big time producer, uh, um, friend and colleague who has got a story and has got a thing or two to share in this in this regard. So yeah. Um, He's bringing, in the around. Yeah. <laughs> He's bringing in the male perspective. His own perspective. We're all bringing our perspective. We're not speaking for all the women, OG. So we don't, yeah. don't give us any responsibility. Okay. <laughs> I, I was listening to the car saying, which kind of burden is this one now, Lord? Okay, he's given us... His own. His, his own... His own perspective exactly. as a male. Don't worry, I'll be biased. I'll just be. <laughs> just say what All right, go on. Go on. You yeah, so, so I think that <laughs> we need to understand that for me as an individual, we're leaving out the companionship part. Where everybody feels that like getting married has to be economic, getting married has to be um, social, ties. has to be family ties, has to be owing to biological clock. For some people, you companionship. Got to get married to pay debt. Yes. Yeah. For some people, it's the companionship that comes first. For some people, they need to check. They check with. Um, a higher being, they check with God, for mm -hmm. instance, and mm -hmm. it, it clicks. Yep. Um, however, you know, way you, that you, you, you know pressure. that God... Peer pressure. Yeah, for some people it's prayer pressure. But for me as an individual, to be very honest, companionship has to be one of the factors why I would want to get married to a particular person. We need to connect on so many levels. And yeah. connecting on so many levels spans all the other things that I've talked what about. What are the levels you would want to connect on, if I may ask? Man, how can you not connect with... I love food. I love food. One of our love have to connect on that level. Food. food. That one is food. without food. Imagine so how being how with I... someone who is like, ah, you eat too much. Ah, that's the end of that. <laughs> 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 okay, like, like if, if we, yeah, okay, let's say it this way. What about if the person is not actually connecting with you, like, in those areas, but you know that the guy is a very good guy that good. you can put. No, Thank I'm you. Saying, I'm sorry, calm down. Good down. So yeah, please go. Like I'm coming from another angle here. Can you still do anything with that same guy, or tell the guy that I mean we are not connecting? I can, because I, I even if I don't have it written down that there are one million things that I want, there are things that I know that I will not compromise on, yeah. and I will sit down and ask myself: Is food something that we can walk around? If it's mm. something we can walk around, by all means. You know, food will come and food will go. And the other things that would matter to me more than food would then mm -hmm. be the things that would determine whether or not I want to stick to this one individual. 
Susie, I am coming. I came there because I went to eat. <laughs> <laughs> I saw as a single, as a single lady. So, hello. <laughs> and something else, you know, to add to what Adenike just said is that a lot of men talk about the list that women have. So you have to have this and call it the impossible list because we are asking for what do you a think? Unique uh, men, what have you heard so far? The it, from the list? Mm. No, the thing is that we have a list and I don't, I think it's actually well, When you say we thing. have a list, you ladies have a list or the guys have a list? Both ways. Okay. The only thing is that women are more expressive, so we sometimes write right out that. But a man mentally in, in his mind, there's no one that goes to get married without having an idea <laughs> of the person he wants to get married to. Now, like Adenike said, there are some negotiables and there are some non-negotiables. What would you negotiate? For me, it would what be... Would, what would, wouldn't you good dresser <laughs> maybe yeah. i want someone with a good dress sense <coughs> that's negotiable nice. do you understand yeah. I, I i wouldn't mind and now again when you, going back to the question you asked i think it's important yeah. i wanted to touch on that that okay what if you don't click can you still go ahead with it if he's a good man do you know what there are many good people who are divorced today because they are not compatible. Mm. Yep. So you cannot. Yeah. What I always say to people is that so many compatibility yeah. is important. So you can have a good man, and I've met many good men in yeah. my life, but we just didn't click, and we wouldn't probably possibly not have made a good marriage Couple, team. Yeah. Yes. So saying that. Not because they're bad. Yes. Not because you're exactly. a bad person. Exactly. Because, because you, you don't. Say, you don't click. I'm, I'm, my friend says it all the time. She's a divorced mother of three kids. And she says that the father to my kids is an amazing man. The fact that our marriage did not work out doesn't mean that he's a bad person, but yeah. they did not connect. I was sharing with OJ knows one story I told him. And young lad, thankfully, just said, you know what, I think we don't connect. Where to, you, you, there's nothing to convert. Yeah. You don't have a con yeah. No conversation. Yeah. conversation. We are no. Okay, let's hang out. You we're both on our mobile devices. Why? Because there's nothing to talk about. It doesn't have to be politics. It doesn't yes. have to be God. It doesn't have to be food. It doesn't have to be fashion. It doesn't have to be deep and say, oh, what are your goals? What yeah. are your goal plans? No. But for whatever thing that we decide to talk about, there is a connector. Yeah. The moment there's no connector, no matter how good a person you are, I'm sorry. I promise you that that thing is headed for the rocks. Very mm -hmm. true. That's, that's what I personally believe. So if you don't know, find that space where you connect as individuals yep. um, irreconcilable differences are just looking in the corner yeah but this particular connection though do, do we have a time frame to it i don't think there's a time frame to 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 it when you see a guy no and you want to give him or you want to see if you guys are you if you guys are connected connect. yeah it happens. You but sometimes, yeah, there should, some, some, I think there should be a time frame. You know, the you dating, need a bit of you, time. The you can't see someone except no, the it's physical. Phase. Oh yes, they got my like, but, you can't meet someone at first and think, yeah. oh, I connect with but you. But that's, oh, that's, 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 <laughs> that's one big, that's one huge problem. That's one huge problem. That's a very major problem we have now from, okay, the young people these days. You're young? Yeah, I know. <laughs> 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 you know, like, I mean, you meet a, like, you, imagine you coming across to, uh, like, you're just seeing this girl, you know, you like, you know, you guys both liked each other at the end of the day, you're like, okay, I like you, okay, I like you too, and you guys are dating. But sometimes they just want it, that connection to happen like that, boom. Hmm. Huh. Okay, so I think understand? I understand what you say. So let's say, yeah. let's, let, let's say a lady who for 26 years has always been setting her ways and a guy from however old he is. Do you understand? And we expect that these two individuals will just... Con well, again, I say that if I can connect with friends that I'm not even emotionally connected to or intending to be connected to, how does it differ with you who I'm hoping that one day will be romantically connected and I, we can connect now? I don't think it's a time frame um, subject, yeah. except when we sit down and we real and we have a discussion and note that there are certain things that neither one of us is not willing to compromise on. Babes, how what is it we're going to do? Imagine that you're with someone let me, instance, you're with someone who gets home and starts to fling around from the from the door. Their footwear, their stocking, their jacket, all of these things. These things are workable. Mm -hmm. Only if the person who's concerned understands that. What isn't workable? What what, what, what would you consider not workable? Right. As in okay, let me give you an example. Oh, God. Yeah, the so, God factor for you. Yeah, yes. Okay. I want to have someone who is. See, I believe very strongly that if you're with someone as an individual who doesn't fear God, you're in trouble. Mm. And the fear of God causes a lot of things. The fear of God is one of the reasons why we would not have issues, even when problems mm -hmm. as to financial crisis. We mm -hmm. will know how to 
go Do around you? things. He won't, if Pharaoh of God is the one who will make him respect me, I would respect him in turn. We respect the children that we possibly will have, respect the union that we have. So for me, something that I will not go down on is a man who fears God. Okay, yeah. so at this point, let, let's pick some calls and um, hear what you guys have to say. And we'll come back to uh, Tenike and Snoozy. Hello. Like what? Getting married. Hi, how are you? What's your name? All right, David, talk to us. What's your angle? Mm -hmm. With God. I once been someone who was an usher in church, had a good relationship with God, but yeah. things were down. He had a relationship with God. And that's why I come to say, we shouldn't mix it your religion doesn't make you a person. Mm. Your character, your behavior does. It has a lot to do with character. Mm -hmm. You know, me and this person were oh, so well, close. He clicked on everything. Yeah. Same, he was more like we were the same era. Oh, but the problem she had with me was I do not have sex with her. Hmm. Hmm. All right, and that was what broke everything. I, oh really? Did you know she I insisted on you guys having sex, and you were like, no. Good lord. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> she, she wanted a piece of... Okay. Yeah. <coughs> All right. Can, can I say something yeah. to that? Even on that level, there's a level at which you didn't connect. Mm -hmm. And that's your moral values. Yeah. yeah. So even if... like, And I, I like the fact that he actually made that clarification between being a Christian or fearing God yeah. or you know what your the religion and like. your, mo your values as well. Mm. I was going to go back to even background. You might both fear God and be of the same faith, but your backgrounds are different. Yeah. Yeah. So the way you do through. things, that's yeah. a huge factor. Yeah. You know, you're, the way you are used to doing things in your family or yeah. your culture. You're, you're set different from, in those Yes, ways. you're set in those ways. Different if from you don't agree, if you're, you're used to a family whereby your father opens the door for your mom, mm -hmm. the women are, when the women are sitting, the men stand up, and you're from a rougher part, where you're thinking, you're from Ghana. 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 You don't have hands. That's, there's actually nothing wrong yeah. with you. Yeah. It's yeah. just that that's just the both way you of are. you cannot work. And because someone will be waiting for the door to be opened, so and the other is looking at your hand like, sister, what so is wrong So these are things that should be discovered mm. while dating, yes. to, to yeah. fine tune yes. before you so get So you know whether to take a walk or whether to stay, if it's something you decide, to stay then you stick with whatever consequences <laughs> yeah. that all right that let's let's pick another call and, uh, hello hi good evening how are you what's your name all right prince so what's your angle this word called connect to me i believe is a um, sacrifice there is no two person in this world that can actually connect oh no bro it's only you have to let go and this person lets go yeah. that is sacrifice and even some of things you hold Precious to me, mm -hmm. just to make. I agree. <clears throat> yeah. He wanted to know no. what she's actually going <laughs> on. Let Does that justify you, it? It wasn't. I'm just. It's a big broken marriages. I am telling you, sex plays about six out of ten. Mm, yeah, six sex, out of ten. So yeah. The lady didn't want to just go into it blind. So, yeah. Oh, she, she. Oh, okay. Your angle now. Your angle is that. Okay. She just wanted to test to see how. <laughs> solid. How many would you test, you guys? I mean, what? How what? many would you? Let's be honest. We're not. I'm not even trying to throw anything. But really, how many are we going to have to test? Yeah. If we continue to throw out that, no. I understand what you say, and I'm saying this as somebody who knows eight couples who have had sex as the crux of why they had to separate. Mm. But I always question, really guys, how many would we test? Mm. Do you know how many people have had near almost married experiences? Yeah, and then we almost got married, and we almost got married. Do we keep doing that? I I, 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 I like the person who called to say your character, but I, I, I differ very vehemently and, you know, so, because if you're someone who genuinely understands what it means in this regard, yeah. you will know for a certainty that where the fear of God genuinely exists, I promise you a lot of things would be in place. Someone mentioned sacrifice. I gave the scenario of the guy who throws things around. Yeah. It's sacrifice that will make him understand that, okay, this, thing, yeah, yeah. this yeah. thing's always upsetting. Okay, maybe I should gradually we start from 
putting his shoes together. He's still throwing his jacket around. <laughs> I'm telling you, because it's... And that's the same thing that will go for her. Babes, I don't like it when you press the toothpaste from the middle. I mean, that's how I've always done oh, in my life. The toothpaste story is... It has oh, broken, I talk, it's broken the yeah. marriage. It's yeah. Toothpaste. Yeah. Honestly. It's but it's when you talk about sacrifice, just to also say from the point of the um, other person as well, even if... So sacrifice is both ways. It could either be that you're the one who stops being dirty yeah. or the other person is more tolerant. So your own yeah. sacrifice is that you are actually going to take it. Off. Yes. Yeah. Either So one person has to... So work. why is it difficult? Why is this? Yeah, just the, stop on. Yeah, the act of sacrifice. Because we are really selfish. Diff- because it's you know I've I've heard it you know so many times, it, especially on the man side, and in these days actually the woman because of you know the rise of you know. Stop um, making that right sound like we're fighting. No, 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 no. We're not. We're not. We're not. I'm just. I'm just. Will you behave yourself? <laughs> no, but I mean, <laughs> let's make a call. <laughs> Hello. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Hello? Hi, how are you? Hey, Mikey, talk to us. Thank you. He wants to bring you something here. You see, when you talk about sacrifice, he said it's not working. He he tied around both parties. Most times, what kills marriage is ego, unwillingness to shift the ground. Mm. Yes, you know, this person is like this. The sacrifice of getting into the marriage means that you are willing to take him for who he is, how you met him, and try to change him. If you refuse it, then that means you have to cope with it. That is when you have gone into that vow. Now, <coughs> when you now get into the vow, you now find it kind of pissy that you can no longer stand this. And you think the end product is to back out? Why did you go into it in the first place? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Hmm. Okay. All right. Um. Okay, that's okay. All right. All right. Thanks. We are always being carried away by the least important thing. And we stop focusing on the most important things that we're supposed to work on. All right. We are dating while we are cutting. In our courtship, they are always there. So they just we are thinking that we can yeah. actually change the person. Change the while you are dating. Yeah, you, can you change Anybody you cannot this? change. Anybody you cannot yeah, correct while you are dating that person. Don't expect to correct that thing in marriage. All right. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Made a whole lot of made a whole lot of sense and points there. You know, a whole lot of things we um, kind of overlook both ways actually while dating, uh, thinking we can manage or can manage or tidy up or pray or change him and do this and do that and you know you get to marry and um, it becomes the obstacle. It becomes yeah. that irreconcilable difference, so to speak. You know. All right, it's the men's room right here, and uh, why did I get married is what we're talking about. Onimisi Adava alongside, oh alongside um, <coughs> Snoozy. Snoozy's uh, Lawrence, um, Adenike, and Ayo. Uh, just looking at uh, my single friends and uh, taking it from their perspective. Are you asleep? <laughs> <laughs> I have stayed on this mountain for too long. <laughs> and now I'm going home. <laughs> they, the, meanwhile, they say marriage makes you attractive. Yeah? Yes. yes. For the men. For the men. And I women. I, I don't know if it's men. God, men. I can see it for, for the men, the right? Men. men. I really? agree with you. I do not kid you. Mm. Yes. It's, it's how, is, how, how does that play oh, for you? Yeah. Talk, yeah. I, 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 my own theory is she oh. comes and she brings a lot of order. Mm. I have seen it. In fact, there's one thing that they don't leave Nigeria. Now. There's one guy, um, Ayo. Ayo was a scruffy looking person. Yeah. He was jagged. He can just. He just want, I'm not so. See how smooth he's looking at I, I don't care how he looks at me. That's how he looks at me Monday through Friday. And in. I'm not messing around. In three months, he changed. Mm. It was just one day he passed. So, ah, I didn't know it was guy? this final. Yeah. I'm not joking. Yeah. So I. I 
I, like I stated, I don't notice women. I'm not into women. I, I notice for the guys. And I still don't understand if there's a scientific explanation. I think it's what also because, I, I believe it's also because it's psychological. We see As a woman, huh. yes, you also think there was something about this man that makes another woman agree huh. to be with him. So is that something, that's that like someone has done the work for you. You don't yeah. need to go and test and see if it's a good husband material. Mm. Uh, woman B has helped you to do the work. Really so that is so all you have to do is to go and re you have not sown. Exactly. Mm. <laughs> exactly. That is where the other woman now comes in to start. You know. So it makes you really attractive. Oh, yes. All of wow. yeah. Whatever oh, is wow. not yours is always more, is better. Yeah. It's better once you kind of looks like it's going to taste better until... Like just last night, my wife and I were saying, I said it's... What is not my own always looks more attractive. And then I'm let's thinking that soon. there must be something that didn't care so in that man that made her say yes. So let's Even, go and look yeah, so but, we must. But what would you say about the women's side? But I said yeah. I already said I don't, well, I'm not into the women, men. So the know. men more than the women. The women maybe because of the no strings attached. Yeah. I hear that the new thing in town is that you date a married woman because you know that she would not want to blackmail oh, yeah, you. Yeah. Yeah. She wouldn't because yeah. she's old. oh is it old? Yeah. The, I hear because that it's not that. You know, you want to go for a married woman because she, she wouldn't make too much of a fuss. No, yes, because she, she has something to lose. Yeah. So <laughs> it's so that's the only time, yes, a woman is attracted. Oh but usually goodness. for the men, ha. It's uh, in fact if you wear the wedding ring on your forehead, bitch, that's even that's easier for that, them. That's actually the attraction, right? Yeah. All right, let's pick this call. Okay. Let's pick this call. Hello? Hello? Hi, how are you? What's your name? All right, talk about what's What's your angle? Talk to us. Short, sharp, and sweet, please. Short, sharp, and sweet. We're out of time. Um, on the other hand, when <coughs> one Hello. person knows that one will How come back uh, about uh, four years now, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. I say, I'm a Christian, I have a Christian, but sincerely, it has nothing to do with religion. Mm -hmm. The truth mm -hmm. is, but you must marry somebody you have to change your mind about. You know, when you're talking about the God content of it, you know, if you're on the same platform, it should be easier because you're controlled by the same line of instruction. You know, you believe in the Bible, the person other person believes in the Bible. People believe in Quran, you also believe in Quran, and things will work out. That is what, then number two, uh, what can keep you that I've seen so far is not trying to change any other person. Never try to change your person. You change yourself. Yes. You know, when people try to change yourself. Can I say, yay! Man in the mirror. Yeah. I saw the That's, that's what? a huge point. Yes. No, it doesn't yes, work. Right. Yeah. Change yourself. When you change yourself, even when you see your man or your wife, yeah, you, you, you can go on conversation. You can talk about it. Discuss about it, okay. but on a different level, you are ready to sacrifice, ready to let go, and change yourself. This is the second sentence in that relationship. Before you know it, it's getting better. Yep. Thank you. Thank you very much. You made a whole lot of points. I like that uh, man in the mirror perspective yes. you brought in. Change, change yourself. Yeah. Yeah, yeah because um, I have I have something concerning that that area of changing yourself. You understand? I think it's a very it's very 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 important, and that's that's a very good point there because you know, like when you see make it quick. We're wrapping okay. up now. Okay, when you see the person you like, yeah, all you just need to do because of, for the sake of likeness mm. and love. You can act, you can actually behave yourself. Get calm you down. Out. I'm not talking go on, to you. Go on, go on, go on, go on. You can actually just change for that person. Yeah. Mm. Make the necessary change. And that's yes. sacrificial now. That's, yes. that's, that's what, sacrificial. Yeah. You, can you know, for me in wrapping up this we're running out of time. I need to wrap up this. Yeah. The case that comes to mind is a couple who's been married for well over fifty years. Over fifty years. As long as they have been together. There's, they still have their differences, yeah. they still have their, yeah. Um, yeah. but yeah. yeah, they have their moments, but they've been able to stick it through mm -hmm. over 50 years. So the point for me is how much more these younger ones who hang out for a couple of months and before you know it, it's irreconcilable <laughs> difference. Like, what is wrong with you? 
So it is possible. It is possible if you just prioritize yourself or prioritize things from the beginning. I don't think you can change anything. Yeah. yeah. All right. Let's let's wrap up. Uh, let me take one liners from you guys and oh, wow. wrap up the show. And I think I'll just tell the line of the last um, comment and say that change starts with you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The honest truth is that if you'd like to see an improvement in your relationship, you need to be as tolerant as possible and just do your bit. I didn't care. Um. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, well, I think that never underestimate the fact that communicating is a very, very beautiful tool mm -hmm. for whatever it is that you're faced with. We both need to learn to communicate. So, yeah. Susie? Yeah, I guess mine is short. I mean, I'll tell anybody, don't just, don't look for, for perfection mm -hmm. or yeah. someone that is perfect. Mm. Just look for that honest. Mm. Do you understand? Yeah. Let's yeah. just go when you can go for someone that is honest mm -hmm. i mean you and have it. Yeah, you have a sweet relationship all right so it's yeah. possible guys it's possible it's possible for you to have a sweet relationship it is. it is very possible thank you so much for listening thank you for calling thank you guys for coming <laughs> yeah. thank you for mr sure. oj thank you. oh yeah and so i rushed my food because of that <laughs> no, what you what i saw on instagram did not look like you rushed it yeah. you took your time. really oh my god okay goodness. we'll talk behind the scenes <laughs> so we'll catch you again same time same time okay. good night god bless you real good bedroom over and out Please click on the red subscribe button below this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel.